mom, I'm, I'm kind of feeling some pains. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. Sorry. Oh, what is this girl? What's her name? Rose. Rose. Yeah. Come. Sir. Help me to massage my leg. But I'm still cooking. Lazy girl like you, you are still cooking since morning. Come on, will, will you massage his leg? Just imagine. What's that? Are you, are you, are you massaging stone? Be soft. Rose, is that spark still remaining? Yes. Okay, just give me one to it. What is she doing? I said, give me food. I want to eat. Can't you say, excuse? I want to go and bring something for her. Leave her. That is how she'll be shaking up and down. You don't have manners. Please. Get out of this place. Go on now. Look at the way she is. What's she doing? What's she looking for? 360. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. It's not a laughing matter. Okay. I don't know what's wrong with that girl. She's just too lazy. But what you said is funny. <laughs> That's is shaky. Please don't match me. What's that? Come on, hold this food for me. Let me eat, I beg. Don't match me, oh, because I will give you slap now. Are you having fever? Why are you shaking? I don't know. No, no, I no. I will just... See, let me tell you something. Eh? It's not as if we are maltreating you. Okay? We are trying to bring you up to a standard so that this is your village mentality, this is your chronic uh, uh, village champion will leave you. Just imagine. That am I? This thing. She is holding me. She was holding me. She wants to. I don't know what. What wrong with you? She was happened? trying to rape me. Trying to rape you? Yeah. You are a very stupid girl. Is it because my precious one, I want to rape you that you are you are screaming as if you want to bring down the beauty? Uh, wait, wait. Look at who they want to rape. Thank God you guys here. Stupid girl. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm hey, I'm not lying. I'm not. So it's because my precious mother who wants to rape you. Just imagine me rape. How can I rape you? He was trying to rape me. See who they want to rape. Good evening. Good evening. Evening. Yes, um, I believe um, we all know why we are here today. We are here for the reading of um, late Mr. Williams. May he so rest in peace. Will. Okay. <clears throat> well, um, before I start, I noticed that um, we are not complete. How? Where is um, Rose? For what? Rose is our house head. Well, um, I cannot continue the reading of um, late Mr. Williams' will without the presence of Rose. Barista, I don't think you, you, you understand what she said. Rose is just a house help of this house. 
So I don't think she has anything to do with this meeting. Um, I'm sorry, um, Mr. Felix. But I said I cannot read this will without the presence of Rose. What are you saying? Rose is not even part of our family. Ah, it's all right. Where is Rose? She's in the kitchen. Rose! Sir? Come. Have your seat. I, I am sure something is wrong with you, right? With the seats on the floor. Um, Barista, she's here. So we can proceed. Um, well, before I continue the reading of this will, I would like to ask you for a little favor. And that is Mr. Felix. Please, can you allow Rose to at least sit on the chair? All right. You can have your seat. Okay. Thank you very much. Well, it says this is the will of um, late Mr. Um, Williams. May so rest in peace. All assets and landed properties, both home and abroad, all industries belonging to late Mr. Williams, should be passed on to. Miss Rose. Excuse me, Barrister. Uh, <laughs> I guess there is a mix-up with the writing and the rest. That name was supposed to be... If it's a female name, it's supposed to be Shalom. Because I don't know who is Rose. I'm not making any mistake. It says here that all acquired properties of late Mr. Williams should be passed down to Miss Rose as the sole owner come on i don't understand which of the rules are you talking about well um um i i won't blame you guys i'm sure your mother is aware of what's going on and i have to you know spill out the beans your mother was aware that your late father was happily married with late miss flora and that marriage was the product of Rose. Yes, I don't know how your mother was able to convince your late father into marriage. I don't know what she used, but I would say kudos. I fear this woman. Well, that is it. Rose now is the sole owner of her father's property. Mr. Ma, what are you even saying? My brother here is older than Rose. That is a question that your mom needs to answer. Right now, I'm giving you 24 hours to vacate from this house. Excuse me, barrister. I, Felix, know my father's signature. So, can I take a look? You can. You can. Thank you. And pass it around, please. Especially to this woman. Eh, what's that? Are you satisfied? Um, well, it was your late father's wish for me to bring back his only daughter to this house. And that is why, and that is why I single-handedly brought Rose, but I knew she wouldn't be accepted as the daughter of Chief of Mr. Williams. So I brought her in as a house help. And when I found out the, the treatment, the bad treatment given to her, I knew that this day would come. She will shock you guys. If you are thinking of any harm towards Miss Rose here, let me tell you, the police, the FBI, 
SARS and SWAT, even the High Court Magistrate, is aware of this case. I will see you guys in my chamber. Mom, what do you have to say about this? Mom, can you at least say something? What do you want me to say? 